Okay guys, welcome back. And today we're doing a little shopping at all of these. And I wasn't gonna make a video, but we found some awesome deals, so I'm gonna show you. So I'm gonna pick up this for me because it's 3 dollars usually at Walmart or Publix, it's double the price. It's smoked salmon. All right, and guys, they have a lot. If you're doing keto, there's a lot of keto-friendly items that I just passed, and I'm gonna show you. They even have brown rice crackers, wow. No, that's not keto-friendly. Is that one? Yeah, so this is keto-friendly. It doesn't explicitly say keto, but it has less than um, 21 grams of carbs. Now, the carb count is going to depend on how many calories that you're allotted to eat today, depending on your weight. But I'm trying to stick with 21 carbs. And you have some cauliflower, vegan. That's vegan and gluten free. Yeah. But what else is in it though? Then they have this that's also keto. It has four grams of carbs. So this is really good. It is on the pricier side. It's about $5 for this. Oh, wow. But then I picked up this to try. I'm excited to try this because I love anything cheese. And this has um, three grams of carbs per serving. So this is keto friendly as well as this. And they're both kind of All right. And is there more? Oh, the cookies. So another thing that that I found that was keto friendly is these cookies. It comes in chocolate or snickerdoodle and it has zero grams of net carbs. I wonder what it tastes like. Yeah. I did not know they had this many gluten free things and keto friendly items. No GMO. Are those keto too? Actually, this, this is keto friendly. It has 18 grams of carbs. It isn't, it's not high in fat, but it's low in carbs. But I only have less than one gram of protein, though. Yeah, but you can have snacks. Not bodybuilding. <laughs> okay. Oh, I'm there, I got. So far, I got the feta. This is $2.99. That's a pretty decent price. Pineapples. And that is actually cheaper than it is in Walmart where I normally get it. And this is actually cheaper in here also, the lemons. And of course, the asparagus, definitely cheaper. So is the romaine lettuce. So I got two of those. And got the bread. And the scallions or whatever you guys, green onions, but they're called scallions. These were actually cheaper here because Walmart, they have like a little bunch and it's like 50 something cents. This whole bag was 68 cents, I believe. And most definitely these small cucumbers were way cheaper here. So let's see what else they have. I'm hoping I don't have to go to Walmart today. I'm not getting any of oh, Junior Wanted cheese. I'm not getting any cheese today because I don't, I don't, Never tried these cheese. You want to try one of those cheese? Yeah, I'll try. Let's try the mild cheddar. I usually get cracked and I'm really funky with my cheese. So we're just going to try one of these. It's $1.65. The craft is usually two something. So you want to go around to the meat and then come back around? And they have the deli cold cuts, $2.99. It's not a bad price. It's not really a lot in there, but enough. I think I'm gonna try that. Well, not me, my husband. I don't eat cold cuts. The pepper jack, let me see. And she's gonna try the pepper jack, and we're gonna tell you, we're gonna do a video on how some of this stuff tastes because I've never, I don't know. Yeah, they have the biscuits on sale. One buttermilk biscuit. Okay, let's see. There's two different prices here. Oh, that's the jumbo and the regular. 
not getting any biscuits. I'm trying to eat clean this this week. And look at these pizzas. Uh, I've heard that these pizzas are good. I've never had them, but I'm not gonna try them. One day I'm gonna try them in, but I'm not gonna get it this week because I need to lose 20 pounds. So that is what I'm working on. Here's some more salmon. All right. The only meat I'm looking for really is chicken. And I wanted, okay, thin sliced chicken breast. Wow, that's really thin. I think I'm gonna hold off on that. Oh no, here's some chicken breast tender one. Now that's not a bad pack. I think I'm gonna get that. I'm not even sure if that's a good price or not. I don't, because the price of chicken has increased so I'm not even really sure because I go to Walmart and it is sky high. Let's see, 90% fat free. No antibiotics, no hormones, no added steroids. This is what I really need to get, but that's a little expensive. And I don't know how that would taste. And their wings, Walmart, the wings was 20 something dollars for a little pack like this. Look at this, guys. Yeah, the prices of wings has risen. So. All right, let's go. You want to go down this aisle? Let's go, let's go back down this way because this. So we're gonna go up this aisle and see. What... And they have a plethora of protein and energy bars. Hey, little keto bar. Yeah, I don't really do bars. Oh, they have a lot. Look at over here too. Oh yeah, yeah. This is like protein oat pancake. Let's see what's in this. Nineteen grams of protein. That's good. I don't know what it tastes like though. I'm trying to see what else is in it. I'm not gonna get that because I'm not doing pancakes. Oh, this is a name brand cereal. I thought it only sold off brands here, but maybe. Wow, look how it, look how this one looks just like the box. The crispy oats, the honey nut. Oh, that is honey nut cherry oil next to it though. You see the difference in price? 185 and 349 and that's bigger. That's crazy. Yeah. Look at this, yeah. Cinnamon toast pack, 159, Oh yeah. I'm telling you, and it's probably the same exact ingredients. I'm telling you guys, check out your local Aldi's if you have one. You don't have to break the bank. And it's obvious you could eat healthy without spending a ton of money if you just come into uh, the Aldi's and just pick and choose what you need to eat to eat right. And the can stuff. Now let's see what else they have over here. The apples. Organic gala apples. I don't know. I, should I buy apples? No, because, yeah, nobody really eats that. The apples kind of goes to waste. Uh, let's see. Croutons, 85 cents. We could try these. But my husband and son, I don't eat croutons. On the ranch. Oh, we don't need ranch, but they do have Hidden Valley Ranch here. A lot of different sauces, Italian. I mean, let's try this Italian. My husband was asking for Italian. We're gonna try that. Onions. Get a bag of onions. Two forty-nine for the onions. Not bad. Oh. Let's see. I'm staying away from peanuts. 
and I have enough almonds at home. And the almond is actually a better price than Walmart. Oh, it's a smaller bag. Not that much smaller, I have to check. Bell peppers, $1.99 for three. That is an awesome deal. Staying away from, tom from tomatoes for now. So let's see. That's down here. And they have a lot of different stuff in now. Oh, these are cute. These are really cute for your yard. Those are $10. see some of these things when I came in the last time. Alright. Now the that is about actually that is cheaper here compared to Bounty. I don't know, I have to test that one day. Then you have your hygiene products here. Let's see? I'm not sure of the toilet paper prices, but you just need to know. $16.99 and you get 30 rolls, 425 sheets. Have your Dawn two ninety four. And uh, let's see. I think these are actually cheaper here. One eighty nine, if I'm not mistaken. The sandwich bags. I'm gonna get one of those. I wanted the one that folds. Let's see. Do they have it? I don't see it. And they also have trash bags. The trash bags, I usually buy them in bulk, so I'm not sure if that's cheaper here. This is like my second time actually shopping in here. And Oh my God, they, my daughter bought a bread the last time she was in here. And it's a cinnamon, raisin cinnamon bread or something. And oh my God, when I tell you, it was amazing. It was amazing. Okay, that's their tuna. Their spices are five cents cheaper. Oh wow, look at these. They have these organic seasoning. $2.69. Okay. Let's see if they have olive oil, but they do have olive oil spray. But I'm not going to get this because guess what? I go to the dollar store and I could get them at the dollar store. This is the bacon items. I don't need any of that. Let's see. Here, see candy, cookies, ice cream. We're gonna walk right past it. Oh, you know Tortilla strips. I'm thinking I'm gonna try for a dollar twenty nine for your salad. I think I'm gonna try these. Well, my husband and son. I don't really eat anything in my salad. Guacamole Ranch. You got chocolates, you got ice cream, dessert. 
not gonna do any frozen fruits because I'm not doing any smoothies this week. Let's see. Shrimp. Hmm. I am not sure. I cannot remember the price of the shrimp. But let's see. Some wanted some nuggets. But I don't know if he's gonna like that kind. He's a little picky. So we're probably just gonna pass, but I let me see. The milk at Walmart is about the same actually. Um it actually went up. The price went up, so I'll just get the milk here. And let's see. Almond milk, eggs. What is that? Maple cinnamon. It's a chip. I think it would go well with cheese. And it, it is keto good. friendly, 12 grams of carbs. I think that's it for me in here. I think this is the yogurt. Kiara said the yogurt was pretty good. My daughter had the yogurt and she said it was actually pretty good. But I don't think it's the cheapest. I don't think that's really. Let's see, ricotta. I don't need any butter. Oh wow, they have strawberry cream cheese here. I did not know that. And it's actually cheaper here than Walmart. I don't know how it tastes, the butt is here. All right, we let's go to the register. We have dark chocolate, 70 per now this is good. Even if you're on a diet, dark chocolate, over 70% of cacao is good. I don't want any chocolate. If I'm gonna eat chocolate, I want the real deal. They do have olive oil, but it's a small bottle for $2.49. I'm not sure that's a great deal or not. So we're not gonna get that. Whoa. Okay, guys, thanks for tuning in to this mini tour of Aldi's and shop with me. Just I wanted to give you guys an idea of what Aldi's has to offer and some prices just to kind of price match a little bit because, you know, we're all about saving some coins for the future.